G'day guys, Alfie here. Um, this is a quick video showing you the student building some cells, um, three-dimensional in Minecraft. Um, the reason I've, I've sped this up about 800 times, it took about, what, an hour and a half or so. Um, and there was some really good learning, there was also some not so good learning. So what I've done is I was going around helping students, I was going around chatting to them, talking about what they were going to do, and then we'd sort of finished one lesson and came back again later and, and talked about that. Um, you can see on the right there a group is building a nerve cell um, in three dimensions, and this is the second or third time these guys have been in this build map and I found that it was much easier for them to build in three dimensions this time than in the previous time that we had been building. Um, and there was also some awesome group work. Um, I think you guys can see it on the left here. There's a student flying in the air there looking down, talking to her teammates, telling them how to make that red blood cell that they're creating into a circle so she's up there saying two blocks this way one block that way do that do this um, which was a really good uh, I thought a really good group group and um, team building experience for them to, to listen to one another and and help each other build um, you can see right over on the left there someone is building a, um, a white blood cell um, and then they said they were finished and I came in and said well no hang on a minute um, does it look like the picture you're trying to build from um, the other thing that I got the students to do was once they'd finished their build and not each group did finish their build but um, they had to write uh, an information block about what their cell job was in the body um, and again that was tying into research in the centre of the screen, off in the distance there, you can see a group building just a big flat square. Um, it was this group that I pulled up on that and um, made them start again because it wasn't looking like a cell and I told them that I wanted them to build a cell, not a, not a big red cube. Um, I don't think they were very impressed. Uh, they were one of the groups that didn't finish their work, of course. However, I think they got there in the end with the understanding as to what I was looking for instead. Um, so I'm just going to be quiet now and let you guys finish watching this and see what the finished product is. Thanks very much for watching.